Hello, this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play Black Geyser Couriers of Darkness, Episode 5. So we've gone out to the uh, outside the city to the Moon we'll Rock area, and we will explore here. You two. So there's an exit there, an exit there. Let's go down and see if we can get to this exit. Weird it showed it on the map like that. Oh, what's this? Looks like somebody's camp, but I don't see any people. Okay, so if you go, so sometimes this is a little like Baldur's Gate, I think, that you can explore the map. So we're here, and that did not give us any new zones we can go to, so we might as well just on continue way. on. Excuse me. Moon Glider. Looks like we can't cross there, so we're going to have to go back here. And cross over here. There's a butterfly. Of course. Basically, just going to explore the map here. I had played the other areas before. I have not ever played this area. Oh. Pause here. Before somebody dies. Okay, there let's have we go. you hmm. run over here and hit it. Hmm. You try I'll stepping go back. Wherever I'm needed. Yes. And you, let's try sparkling it. Agreed. Whoops. I'm, what do you wish of me? It's nice to be needed. That seems like the place to be. Well, this looks uh, like something to investigate. It's like these rocks are floating around this tree. Pause. Okay. You will see the end. I will end them. Why not? Here we go again. I'm always ready. Oh, we forgot the long sleep. Let's 
go ahead and see if it will let us long rest here. So we can get spells and such back. It did, unfortunately, it makes it night. Makes it Let's harder see. to see things. Whoops. Again, we want all of you. Yeah. Of course. I don't know why rocks are wandering around this tree. Some magical reason, I assume. Actually, we should do a quick save here. Do, do, do. Never hurts to have an extra quick save. Okay, so we've sort of got that side and that side down. I guess most are down here. That's weird. I like to get the edges of the map first. Unless I know something specific that I'm heading to. I'll do it. Huh. Looks like that should be a cave or something, but apparently not. More butterflies. Oh, another bush. Has more moon gliders in it. Oh, that's right. We should probably check because that I bet our potion's done. We'll find a solution. Yes, yeah, so our potion is indeed done. Let's start brewing another. Are you certain? Where will we meet? Why not? That seems like and the more place foxes. to be. This world has lots of foxes. In fact, I think foxes are the only non hostile animal I've seen. Okay. So let's head towards the middle now. Another fire. Another empty fire. And this must be the moon rock that it's named after. That's also interesting. So all these empty areas. On my way. The campfires burning with no one at them. Makes me suspicious. Oop. More bushes. This time it's weevils. You never know when you're going to need a weevil. Oh, there's bad guys. Where will we go? I welcome pain. It's nice to be needed. I'll go wherever I'm needed. Yes. Actually, let's go ahead and hit this guy instead why not you've got this coming
What do you wish of me? Did I just kill myself? I think I just killed myself. Sigh. Hence, why you quick save? I've noticed it's very, very easy to die, and there's no, as far as I know, there's no raised dead, nothing like that. There's no unconscious, you know, you take damage, boom, you're dead, boom. And since you don't have any sort of um, formation, it's real easy when you're exploring stuff to die. So let's go down here and... I'll do it. Try moving off this edge, see if we find something new we can move to. Because we didn't do that last time. Nope, still nothing new. Okay. So let's, this time... Do this a little smarter. Where Just have we go? you wander to here. Pause. Okay, yes. you shoot Your that guy. Aim. My I'm you. always ready. Let's go ahead and just summon some things to keep them busy. And then this ends now. And always remember their weapons drop on the ground separate. So you're going to always have to go and find those differently. Okay. Much better that time. Actually, let's just take a short rest. There's no reason to use a spell. What? Yeah, on my way. Okay, so that time we got the bandits. Or is there anything else over here? Not seeing anything. Ah, that unlocked the Vinter's Grove. So, but we're going to stay here. But we now know how to get to the Vinter's Grove. Which is good. And get our of course bloom wings. Fox. And over here we have these. Ooh. That's another potion. Well, speaking of potions, we restored, didn't we? So we probably need to go to you. We'll find a solution. 
brewing. You can go to this person. We'll make more potions. Start brewing. And we should probably hand off a bunch of this stuff. So you go to that person. This would actually give them more protection versus the not focus or but it does give a plus on charisma. So that will go to you. That we'll have to think about. Thick leather boots, these all go to you. You're our cell horse. Hunter's bow, we already got one of those. Dagger. <coughs> Spiked mace. Chain skull cap. Let's give that to you. Another chainmail havoc. It's nice to be needed. Have you give me this here and this here. Give you a little more armor class. Replenish your arrows there. Those are your fire arrows. Okay, and let's check with you here. Pretty sure you have better armor. Yep, your armor is better. This should be good there. Let's go and have you put that into your potion stash. Okay. Let's get everyone back okay. together. I'll go wherever I'm needed. And look at the map here. Oh, mushrooms. Actually, let's go ahead and select I'm you. I'm always ready. Yeah, that seems like the. You find a solution. Okay. That's nice to be needed. This I'll do it. Fire by that floaty stone. Let's continue down this way. Oh, mushrooms. Yes. Agreed. I yeah. That seems like the place to be.
Oops. What do you, you, wish you just me? go and get them because I just need to transfer them to you anyway. It's nice to be needed, of course. Oh, there's some people. Hello. Greetings, traveler. Care to take a little break with us? I carry a selection of wares for taste for someone like you, if you're interested. I'm not sure you chose the best place to sell your merchandise, friend. You're pretty hard to spot sitting behind this rock. A fair observation. You see, we're in a bit of a pickle here, friend. On our way up north, my trusty companion here took a glance of a group of ruffians blocking the road. Needless to say, I'm sure they are the sort that preys on small fish like myself. Byrne can handle himself in a fight all right, but they have numbers. So we decided to settle down for a bit and see if they decide to rob and pillage somewhere else. You know, I see an opportunity for a good deal here. If you could somehow get them to stop blocking the way, that would find a rather grateful trader back here, ready to honor your deeds. Those three tough guys up the road, they had more bark than bite. You need not worry about them anymore. Oh, this is wonderful news indeed, and since I already offered a reward, here, take this fine belt made by Elvin Craftsman. You earned it. Uh, what are you selling? All sorts of things for daring adventurers who seem to be. I carry some sets of armor and weapons and tools for everyday survival in the wilderness. My prices are quite reasonable. On the other hand, I'm also interested in buying valuables you happen not to be in need of anymore. I'm sure we can work out a deal to benefit us or both. All right, uh, let me take a look. As you wish, my friend. And I believe this is the only other merchant in the beta right now so so first of all we need to go to you and select all common and sell okay so they have a traveler's cane which isn't really better than anything I have fine morning star covert dagger Hmm, so that might be worth taking for Thomas here. Moon gliders, weevils, pity ring, light armor, butcher knife. Lantern. Lanterns might be something worthwhile. So let's buy one lantern. And let's buy five candles. And horn skull cap. Marksman's bow. We definitely want that. Gentleman's walking stick. Wow, that does a lot of damage, doesn't it? Quarter staff, glade hide, these are all things we sold them. This adds two to the dexterity, well I think we want to buy those as well. <laughs> don't really see your reason for the horned helmet okay let's see what we got here so first of all we're going to replace your bow with the one that has 
2% critical chance and 5% accuracy. Think. So these boots give you less heat and cold, which I'm not so worried about. No bargain and persuasion, but give you hide and sneak. Uh, but the two dexterity is what I'm really putting them on there for. This gives a plus there. Okay, this gives you plus two aim accuracy and plus two invasion. Where do belts go? Oh, there they are. Oh, you've got a belt. Gives you 2% evasion. Let's go ahead and take switch you out and give this to this person. So can this go down here? Nope. that to her. Okay, let's put more stuff here in your inventory. And we'll give that to her. I'm always ready. So it's a light source, but I don't know how to use it. Looks like she already has a belt. So let's give you the belt. Hmm, I have no idea how to use that lantern. Where will we go? Looks like you already have a better belt. Okay. Hmm. Let's drop our sale items to sell here. What do you wish of me? Any reason to keep this? Eh, we'll keep it. She's under carrying capacity. We're fine. Okay. That worked out well. Good why not? So we completed that mini quest. I'll go wherever I'm needed. So we need to go this way. There's the animal we killed. Yes. Mushrooms. And whatever this is. Help oh, more bruise weed. Always useful. Yeah. Hmm. On my way. I think that pretty much explores this map. So let's go ahead and head up this area. And head towards the grove. And I think that's where we'll wrap up this episode. So as always, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and give me a like or a comment. And if you dislike the episode, leaving me a dislike is fine, but please leave a comment saying why you disliked it. As always, this is Spidey1958, and 
have fun gaming.